So hi, this is Ginny with LearnWithGinny.com. I share all the internet marketing uh, stuff that I'm learning with my awesome moms out there. So I'm an uber busy mom and I help other uber busy moms get their businesses, their home businesses on the internet so that they can um, generate traffic and leads for their home business. And these are targeted traffic and leads. And let me get into that. I'm just going to dive right in and make sure that if you're on, I keep looking over here because I have Facebook Live over here. If you chime in live, tell me where you're from, your name, and then just ask me any questions that you have that I can um, answer in future lives because I'm here every weekday morning at 6.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time-ish. <laughs> it's, um, it's Facebook Learn With Ginny. Okay. So today um, I got some notes from the infamous Vince Reed who is the expert in traffic for your websites. And I can't believe I never shared this. I have the four steps right here, and I never shared it with you. So here I am sharing it. It gets a little bit complicated for some of you who might be beginners in internet marketing, but you know I'll gladly explain in more detail some other time if you need to dive in deeper. And I can tell you where to find the training to get, you know, get into the meat of it. So there's four steps. The step one is to create content. Your content feeds your audience. Your audience is there because you have an answer to a problem. You have a solution to a problem that they have. In this case, the problem is I have a website, I have people visiting the website, but nobody's buying anything. So this is, you know, four step process on how to get people there. Now think of your content as a mini lead magnet. Now for my new moms out there, my new mom bloggers, you, your lead magnet is something that you give away for free. In this case, your content is your lead magnet in this case. And it's, it's a mini lead magnet because you definitely do have to have your lead magnet on your page. And this lead magnet is something that people will be willing to give you their email for. It would not be uh, sign up for my newsletter. Who wants another newsletter in their email? No. It would be something like um, Okay, I use an EMP one actually. It's not even my own, but I believe in it and I do know the course inside and out. I offer a 10 day boot camp on how to recruit customers on the internet. It's free and it will teach you some of the basics of getting your customers on the internet. And you can find that at the bottom of each post almost every post because sometimes I offer something else like if I'm giving you mindset tips I might change my offer to my five steps to manifesting your goals which is more like reaching your goals it's a five-step process on actually you know really visualizing and really we're getting yourself motivated to work towards those goals anyway those are just as some examples of lead magnets if you need more, if you go to my products, learnwithginny.com forward slash products, there, I believe, I can't remember if it's on that page or not, but there is a free, you know, seven step um, to creating a lead magnet thing. So you can use, you can go and sign up for that and get that too. So content, right? Your mini lead magnets. Um, I think I already said that your content should solve a problem, which is why I ask you to ask me questions. And if you don't ask me questions, that's okay because I get questions all the time in my email and on in my groups and forums. So 
it's it's easy to find content it's easy to find questions that people ask for your content and you want to be congruent with whatever your niche is if you're in the health and wellness business people are going to want to know how do i lose this belly fat how do you know what what are some hacks i can do to my diet that is easy that won't take a lot of effort you know it's just things like that um, Ray Higdon, I love his idea of taking pictures of magazine covers um, when you're standing in line at the grocery store because those are expert copywriters. They have, there's a reason why those headlines are there and they pop out at you. Use those headlines for ideas. Okay, so content. Your content also can be, it can be in the long form, which you're written out. I always do some written out because the search engines can find your content easier that way. And Google, for example, will know if your content is relevant to whatever somebody's searching for. So you get more organic traffic that way. Um, but two other ways you could use audio and you could use video. Now I stack it because I actually put a little bit more meat into my videos and put them on the bottom of my post. You know, I say, watch the video because I want them to stick around. I want them to stick around and stay on my website for a while. So, on to step two. And we're going to run out of time real quick here because <laughs> ah, I'm going too long. So, content. Um, and then step two is to drive targeted traffic to your content. And this is where you place ads on Facebook, Twitter, Yahoo, Bing, Google, wherever, whatever your favorite way. You don't have to use them all, especially in the beginning, because you only want to master one skill in the beginning, right? You only want to master one platform, okay? I know it gets, I got really excited in the beginning, and I started placing ads everywhere, and I spent a lot of money that way, and then got nowhere, because... I was too scattered. So stay focused on one platform. Learn one and master it. Then start. you can start building from there and applying it on the other platforms. So what I mean by targeted traffic is make sure that you know who your customer is. Where is she? Who does she hang out with? What groups does she hang out in? Um, what kinds of activities does she do? You know, what's she interested in? What are her pains and struggles? What keeps her awake at night? Okay, these are things that you can, I mean, it's amazing how detailed you can get in your targeting on Facebook, Twitter, um, not so much on, on the search engines, as much detail there, but if you pick the right keywords, you'll be targeting the right people. So if you haven't been to placing any ads and I'm totally speaking over your head, don't worry about it. You have to start where you're at. Step three is to capture your custom audience. Now this goes a little bit deeper. And what your custom audience is, is once you build on a platform, I'm gonna use Facebook as an example because that's the one that I started out with. And on it, you can, as you build your audience, you can target a lookalike audience, which is more, more people that are similar to the people that like your page already. Or you can put your pixel, there's a little pixel from Facebook and Twitter and all the search engines that you can put in the header of your website. It collects a little piece of digital information, not digital information that I can see, so I don't know that Amy visited my website. I don't know that. I just know there's like a thousand people in this audience when I create it from this pixel. These are people that visited your website and you can target them with step four, a strategic offer because you know that they're already interested and now you can say, hey, look what I have that might be an excellent solution to your problem. I hope this makes sense and I hope it helps. It's exciting what you can do with all this. I mean, it can really, really make a huge difference in your sales. Um, I'll be honest, at here at this point, I'm not quite there where I am retargeting yet. 
because I don't have that big of an audience yet. So don't worry about it if you're not there. I'm just sharing with you something that I learned and it helps solidify what I'm learning for myself too. So it's a little bit of a selfish reason, but it also helps you, I hope. So make sure you share and comment if you need any, any ask your questions. Go to learnwithginny.com forward slash blog. I will have this post up later this morning so that you can go check it out in writing and get your free training. See you there. Have a great day.